welcome viewers to softidemy a software engineering academy and today we will discuss about a solution an error come in primavera p6 and let's go into primavera p6 we'll see what the error and what the solution is so i will discuss you about how this error comes and why this error comes and what are this error solutions so today we'll discuss about the log file cannot be created error so in scheduling during scheduling a primavera page 6 project is this a software issue is this a programming issue or is this a windows issue so we will discuss about that one so here when we go here in the schedule you can also press f9 and this uh, option and i will press f9 it's better for me so i am just printing using primavera p6 20.12 version so first of all we will see here this window and then schedule this window see here when we schedule this one this project project will be scheduled in that date so apply to select it so this is done why this error not appeared oh we will go again this error not appear because we haven't created a log file. So sometimes when you click on that one, every system default clicked on that one log to file. So log of the file of Primavera P6 while scheduling is created in your system when you are scheduling. So when you click on schedule, so this error comes. It's, it's obviously in your system. If you don't create the log file, so you can schedule. But why we need log file? So the log file is a file which have all the data during your scheduling. It will show you all your warnings, predecessor, successor, all details of your schedule will be appear here. So it's not creating. What the solution is? Log file. Let's see. We can only create log file. So we can schedule, but it's not happening. So we can also change the append to existing. Maybe there is an existing file. We can change that one. With scheduling. Let's see view, view log. Maybe view log will work, but it's not working. So what the solution is? So this file cannot be created and this cannot be scheduled until this file create. So why this issue comes, I will show you. So this location, this, the issue is the location issue. So the file have a location which is restricted by the windows. So you are administrator you are the most uh, super user of your system but being an administrator you are not allowed even your program is not allowed to create any file or any text file in your c drive directly so directly some privileges from administrator to extract any file or create any file automatically generated from any software so we will go here location of that one so that location we will change into another location for example we will change that file into documents we'll go here in the documents and here documents we can create that file open here is not file you can just open that one so the location of that file is going to the user document and now the schedule log so now if there is file we can write our existing so now we will schedule this schedule is done so also the log file is created now what we will do we will view the log so here you can see the log is created and you can see a lot of details here also when we go here and we can overwrite existing to make a lot of files while you schedule you know you have to schedule about after one day, two day, three day, there will be a lot of log files. So you can use our our at existing. So our at existing will be change your the files, the maximum file creation here. So you can schedule that one again and again. You can view log. If you want to change the location of that log file and you want to create a log file to submit your client, so you can create that log file for baseline and you can submit to your client. It's your choice. So there is an also latest feature in the 2021-2 is XML, XTML, so XTML having a grouping system. So I will show you the same one. It will be beneficial for you. So see here, HTML file is created. Now we can view the HTML file. So it can be open in any browser, in any HTML based software. So you can just drag it or down a lot of, a lot of activities. It's like the Primavera. So you can view all of the activities from 
there and all of the function scheduling and leveling report you can get whole report the name of the program within a specific range within a in a defined and well manner you can see in the html format so this is the solution so while you are while you are creating any new schedule and while you install a new program this problem comes and this is not a program issue this is this is issue from the windows side windows do not allow us to save that log file into a system so that's why because of that one you can't schedule so some we have also selected the log file so until the log file not generated the schedule cannot be done so this is the solution so thanks for watching soft demi if you till not subscribe my channel please press the subscribe option and if you don't press the bell icon till now you will not get the latest upcoming notification so please press the bell icon and share it with your friends and must press like and comment us which video you required for next or if there is an error you can also email to us a softy demi at the rate of gmail.com the email address is given below and any help we will provide so thanks for watching softy demi again